And I wanted to bring on today um, one of the women who took the course, because sometimes I think it's just easier to hear from someone who's been there, right? Many of you may have questions about the program. Is it right for you? Is it not right for you? Um, it's an investment. So you have to like make a good decision, right? Sometimes you just want to know, like, is it worth it? You know, is it, is it any good? Like what's so special about this program? And so I wanted to bring on one of my favorite people. I didn't know Clarissa at all before the program. Clarissa happened upon um, the transformational program last spring and took a chance and, um, and signed up. And here we are, right? Like, I don't know, almost a year later, yeah. still connected. Let me introduce Clarissa. She is a mother of three, um, lives in Florida. She is a, a pharmacist um, in her career. She is a strong mom. She's a strong advocate for her um, kids, especially her daughter. Um, and yeah, Clarissa, I just want to thank you for coming on. You are so welcome. I'm happy to be here. Awesome. So I thought maybe I would just kick it off by asking you some questions that other people might be wondering about. The first question I have for you is when you stumbled across the program, what were you frustrated with? What were you dealing with at the time? It's, it's funny that you say the stars aligned or, or what have you and for us to meet because I was probably having one of the worst parenting days of my life. And for some reason, I got an email from you talking about transformation um, of your kids with ADHD. And I thought, I didn't even know this was a thing. And um, I had my child was diagnosed in January and this was maybe April or May, I think. Um, and it was just a terrible day. The house was chaotic. And I got an email talking about transformation of your parenting with children with ADHD. And I thought, I'm going to, I got to do something. I am the worst mother in the world right now and I need to change. And so it was truly just the timing was unbelievable. And I think you and I've talked about that, that I don't even know how I got on. You uh, did. You're like, oh, I don't know how I found this. I'm like, well, <laughs> email the universe you. said she needs this. <laughs> <laughs> and just as a warning um, for everyone, sometimes when, so Clarissa and I spend a lot of time together in um, support group, kind of in group coaching calls. And for some reason, um, whenever we're together, there are some, some tears and like emotion. Cause we just, um, there are things that we just do for each other when you become close knit like that. So, um, okay. So when you were thinking about signing up, you were like, gosh, this just came in my inbox. Like where did you have any like second thoughts or anything that almost made you not sign up? Yeah. I think the only thing was the time commitment. I wasn't sure of how long um, I would need to spend each week. I loved the fact that it was online and self-directed. And then there were options to either join you live on Facebook or not to watch it after the fact. Um, but I was still concerned, am I going to have enough time? It's, it's, a, it's an investment and I want to make sure that I get the most out of it. So will I have the time? Um, and it out it. <laughs> but that was my hesitation going into it. Yeah. And what did you find uh, along that? Because I've actually got a field of a few questions today about that. Uh, because all the videos were online and even if they were longer than maybe you had, you could stop the video and you would come right back to where it was. So if, even if I only had half hour for um, to sit down and, and do it, I could and come back and then pick up where I, I left off. And I really found that and I'm sure that other people uh, could, could attest to this. It's really what you put into it. I mean, the videos don't take that much time. And it really is what, what do you want to do with the activities and how much do you want to implement them? And even if you don't get to them that week, I mean, that was one thing that you were really good about that if you got behind one week, there was enough breathing room that you could still catch up or um, not not fall far behind. And that happened to me a couple of times where maybe I didn't implement things as immediately as I wanted to, but I was still able to, to do it when I had time. Yeah. Um, I hope that makes sense. But no, it I doesn't make sense. Um, okay. So, you know, tell, tell us a little bit or tell those of you who are uh, people who are watching, you know, one thing I say is like, this is not like a, we can't, we can't cure ADHD. We can't parent ADHD out of our kids. Right. Um, so how did this make things better? Because I know things aren't perfect for you and your family. That's not, you know, I say that a lot, like this isn't about becoming perfect. This is about something else. So what did it turn into for you? How did it make things better? 
Um, I act, even though I'm a pharmacist, I had, didn't really have a lot of knowledge on what ADHD really truly is. I, um, my first exposure to it was in the nineties when I used to dispense Ritalin more commonly than I dispensed any other medicine. And so I got a very skewed and just wrong impression of what ADHD is. And so that was one thing that was so eye-opening when I learned the physiology behind what is going on in my child's brain. It, there really was an aha moment for me, for example, the pause that they don't have, that was really understanding them when my daughter would sometimes hit me out of the blue. And I, you know, that was something, this was new for her. And I just, uh, the emotional, uh, you know, learning about the physiology really helped with that. But also you have such small, incredibly important, but easy to implement techniques for us um, to just really help our children. And I would even talk to my husband and say, can we maybe not approach the situation negatively and approach it positively in this manner. And you know what? It worked. It, she was able to um, not have as, as big of an emotional outburst just on making small minor changes in the way that we talk to her. I mean, things that really were really life-changing for all of us and, and her siblings that uh, struggled to. That's awesome. Um, so what results are you the most thrilled with with the program? Honestly, it's the anger management on when she gets really upset, how to handle. And she was involved in designing that plan on when you get out of control, which made all the difference in the world. Instead of me just saying, go do this, because she decided to do it, it she wants to go now and get her, um, her anger under control. And then she'll come back. Yeah. And she'll say, I'm sorry. And she's back to the, the little girl that she was, you know, a few hours earlier. Yeah. That's, that's been awesome. the biggest wonderful and, change. Yeah. And that's what I always talk about is like, okay, so at the beginning, I think, tell me if I'm wrong, but at the beginning, sometimes it feels like as we're really learning the foundations, it's like, um, are we going to be babying these children? Are we going to be like enabling them to like always, you know, kind of um, not live up to their potential, but the whole point is to empower them. Yeah. to have their own control over all of this. And yep. so I'm so That's glad that, that was part of your transformation. Yay. <laughs> we were, I feel like we were walking on eggshells around her before. And now it's, it's a, it's, it's not like that. We don't have to walk on eggshells and, and change is happening. Yeah. But as you said, it's not perfect. We still make mistakes. Um, I still go back and look at things and um, yeah, so it's continue building or continue yeah. practice. We are too. And it's, um, but it's that confidence. Like I can just see the difference in you of that confidence of, you know, parenting. It's just awesome. Yeah. Okay. So if you were going to talk, think about like who should sign up for a program, who should sign up for this program? Like what kind of, um, what kind of mom or not even kind of mom, but like, you know, in what situations would you say someone would be a good candidate for this program? I certainly would expect anybody that was where I was at my wit's end to want to do this program, but I would highly suggest doing it before then. Um, <laughs> because, um, and even if you've, I, I had not been dealing with ADHD for very long, but there were parents on the program that have been dealing with ADHD for five, six, seven, eight years, and they still got benefit because of um, not only the, um, the, the, lectures, or I don't want to call them lectures, but the videos, but also the interaction. Um, I didn't do a lot on the Facebook page, but we had a parent support group and that was huge. And so for me, I felt very isolated because I, I didn't know anybody who had a kid that truly had ADHD. I mean, people say, oh, I have ADD. Well, no, they don't. And, it, and they don't truly understand the change in your house. And so to be able to talk with people, um, and hear them. I mean, we, you know, we cried. I know the first day everybody got on and their faces came up and everybody was like, I'm sure I have the video. I should, I should put that into like a reel. Or something. <laughs> but everybody was like, ah, just seeing each other. It was so, it was the most surreal thing. And there were moms that have had children with 80. I mean, one mom, I think her kids were in their twenties and she was still sitting, mm -hmm. right. And so I don't think it has anything to do with the age of your children or your experience. Anybody can benefit because there's support. And then you have a ton of additional resources. That is one of the biggest, I, I mean, I spent a lot of time just clicking through the additional resources, books and other videos that were extremely helpful videos for the kids to watch, to try to explain that hand one, the 88 for the brain. I mean, just really great material. Yeah. 
Awesome. I'm so, it's so good to hear all of that. So um, what would you say to parents who are kind of on that fence? Like, what do you think that they would be missing out on if they decided not to take, to do the program? I think um, that sense of other people understanding what you're going through and having, I don't know um, how everyone else is, but for me, just reading on Facebook or talking with other people in the group that they were going through the same things as me, it was, uh, it was just rewarding to not, not rewarding is not the right word. Um, it just was comforting to know I'm not alone. And so even though maybe I knew, actually I didn't, but even if they know some of the stuff that they're learning, I think that support from other parents and ideas, oh my gosh, my child is doing this. We've tried this. Do you have any suggestions? So that to me is the big thing you'll be missing out on is this community, yeah. smaller community. The, so for people who have been asking questions about, you know, do I, am I ready to make this investment? Isn't going to be right for me. I want to make sure that you understand that I do offer a 30 day money back guarantee. So what that means is that if you get into the course, it's 30 days from the date, the course starts. If you get into the course, you take the videos, you, uh, you watch the videos and you do the homework and you're still like, this is not right for me. You hand in that homework and within 30 days of the course, and I just give you your money back. I don't want, I've never had to do that before, <laughs> but it's there because I don't want people who aren't getting something out of the course, who have tried it and aren't getting something out of the course to have to continue in the course if it's not right for you. So just so you guys know, if you're on the fence because you're like, I don't know, if, you know, this is gonna be worth it. There is that option there. It's it's not- guys, it really changed my life, um, the, the course, and that's why I'm here. Um, I volunteered because Erin, she's changed my life. And I think that you, if you talk to anybody who took the course and went through all the, the, th- the videos as well as the assignments and really put time and effort into it, um, I think every single person will tell you that. So okay. it's really worth the money and the, the time. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Chris, for coming on. I really appreciate it. Yes. And um, thank you everybody for joining us and let us know if you have any other questions.